Yeah, it was my glass. So we had a little bit of trail damage yesterday. So you can see that door's all crinkled up. I pulled out the wing window. The glass blew out. The wing window's got a little bit of a uh, crunch to it. But we're gonna work on popping the vent out with this football. <laughs> Let's go look on the other side. Okay. All right. Let's see. Your eyes. <laughs> oh, there we go. We got the big one. All right. So that worked. I think if we go and put that up uh, a little higher, I think we'll get that other one too. That was pretty cool. <laughs> I like that, huh? Didn't work too well on that one. Yeah, try it on the big one. What I could do is just run one of my airlines from the compressor, and every time I hit my door, I just shh. Yeah. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> nah. Let's see if it pops. Took the wrinkle out. Yeah. The fucking ball's gonna explode and scare the shit out of me. So as you guys saw, I was popping out dents with, you know, balls, mostly football. And uh, the door's not perfect, but good enough for this. I'll end up getting a new door when I do the uh, body work on this, so I'm not too worried. But I went to the parts truck. I got a piece of glass for the door. And then I was playing with this, the wing window. And I went and I uh, tried to fix this little crimp here. But I don't know if you can really see it. But I'm gonna go compare it to the one that was in the parts truck. And if that one's better, I'm just gonna throw that one in. Then I'm hoping to seal the truck back up, be okay with the door, and then move on to uh, maybe fixing my linkage up front that's bent there. From there, I'll work on the brakes. I don't know if I'll get to that today, but we'll see. So it's pretty clear this one got crunched pretty well. In the right side is the one from my parts truck, a nice sweeping arch. And then there's the one for my truck. Two sweeping arches, almost like McDonald's. So uh, we're going with the parts truck one. We're not going to waste any time on this. And we're going to just get to it. Let's install this thing. All right, so we're all glassed back up. Let's go check and see how this works. You can still hear a little bit of the old glass in there. All right. Pretty cool. Put it back up and see how it looks. To do that, I'm just going to go move this. Move that. And let's see how this glass looks in there. All right, a couple paint issues, but I mean, not the worst thing in the world. Wow, this is a dent right here. I didn't see too great. And then this here, I don't know if I want to hit that down with the glass in there. Um, meh, I'll just leave it for the time being. I don't want to blow that glass back out, so. We'll see. As you can see, we have window glass in, so we're on to our next activity, which is drinking beer and straightening our steering. So to do that, I have my winch coming out 
to a tree saver and a snatch block. And then it's going back here to a strap wrapped around my bent steering. You can see it's just not straight there. So I have it where I believe is the impact point. Maybe I'll have to wiggle it a little bit over. I'll do that now. I think that's about the deepest part there. And uh, I'm gonna go pull this back and stand out of the way of the winch in case something breaks. So, let's see. Try to get you guys in a position where you can see it. Uh, here maybe. It's moving, but it's also pulling the truck. Let me uh, put the parking brake on or something. I'm afraid it's gonna break something. Well, you know, let me chalk the front wheels. Okay, so I stuck some bricks under the uh, front wheels. Put the emergency brake on. Let's try this again. All right, we're about straight, but I need to go past it. Past it. Let's see if it goes and springs all the way back. All right, let me try that one more time. I think we're still a little bent. Let me make sure these wheels are chalked. I guess that's as good as we're going to get. Let's try and pull it a little bit more. All right. Straighter. I don't know if you guys missed that because I was blocking it. Um, let me try one more time, maybe. I wasn't perfectly happy with how it came out, so I ended up moving the strap around, pulling it some more, and I got the bar pretty much straight. For whatever reason, I didn't get that on video, so instead I thought I'd show you where I mangled it up to begin with. But for the most part, these were two quick fixes. They got the truck where it needed to be. It's all sealed up, and now you know the steering straight, so I could drive it again. The next thing up is Hydro Boost Brakes, so that'll be the next video. If you want to see that, be sure to subscribe, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a good one, guys. Yo, you got a big rock in front of you, you're not going to make it.